Kate the Great here. Welcome back to my channel. It's really nice to have you here. Today we are going over everything involving the wrist. We are working on increasing the range of motion within our wrist. Very, very, very important. We are learning to strengthen our hands, strengthen our flexors, increasing our range so that when we load weight on, whether it's in a plank, a push up, a bear crawl, any, literally anything in our lives, we will have nice strong hands, nice strong wrists. Everything will fire and be nice and mobile so that we don't have any pain. This may help relieve any pain that you have or prevent any pain from happening, which is what we all want, right? We all want to constantly increase strength, increase range of motion, progress so that we can live great functional lives. I will go over the game plan. Here we go. Wait, before we get into the game plan, as you can tell by the title, this is a follow along sequence of exercises because you and me, we are in this together. I will guide you through the entire thing. My advice is to do this at least one to two times a week. Give this video a like, subscribe down below to my channel so that you can always come back and do this with me. All right, now let's go back to the game plan. And here we go into the game plan. We are going to be doing six different exercises, moves throughout the entire sequence. We are going to start first with a roll, AKA a release, a self myofascial release, basically giving yourself a massage. Options with the rolling, you can use a ball, a little roller, a big roller. If you don't have any of these things, that is totally okay. You can literally use your own hand or your own knuckles to really, really, really dig in there, release out the flexors. From there, we are going to work on some wrist rocks, rocking forward, rocking back, side to side, circles, and then circles the other way. Next, we are going to learn to open our hands, learning to increase the range of motion, getting a nice 180 degree line across. Number four will be spreading the hands apart and then gripping the fingers really, really, really close together. Working on opening up, increasing the range of motion within our hands and then strengthening the intrinsic hand muscles. The next part we will move into floor grips, working on gripping into the floor and then placing our weight into the ground. Letting our hands know, you know, that they gotta run the show. I mean, you have five fingers in each hand. Why are we not using them? Learn to grip. It'll go a long way. And then to end, we will be doing planks together. You and I, we are going to hold a plank. Basically the end result, the end goal of what we want when we're trying to increase the range of motion. Learning to put all of our weight into our hands without any pain, preventing pain, all of that. Here we go. Go. Alrighty, the roll is up first. Like I said, we are going to roll out the flexors. You can grab whatever you choose to use, what you can use, and what you have to use. One minute per side, I'll tell you when to switch. Here we go. I'm thinking about the days we used to shine when we were young. I told you that we should start a band. And reach for the sky It's 2 a.m. and I can't fall asleep I'm just not tired I can hear the raindrops falling It's cold outside And I kind of feel like calling But it's too late now I just miss you I just miss you Such a constellation, right? No, you to agree. Made a reputation for ourselves at age 18. We had and good. One minute is up. You're going to switch to the other side. Here we go. Oh, I miss you. 
the roll. Hopefully you're feeling a little bit looser. We are going to go into what I call wrist rocks. So they're gonna be four moves each. We're gonna spend 30 seconds with each. I will tell you when we move on. I'm just gonna go over them really quick. First thing, we'll start with our hands forward. You're gonna rock forward and backwards like this. From there, we're gonna go side to side. Depending if you're close or further away, you might feel more of a stretch. We'll go side to side like this. Then we will flip around so that your fingers will be facing towards your knees and we will rock back into it. And then the last one, you're gonna flip your hands back around and we'll do a little bit of circles. Make sure you're not putting too much pressure into your wrist. Everything should be super lightweight, no pain at all. Again, just working on a light range of motion and getting ourselves all warmed up to increase our wrist mobility. Here we go, 30 seconds, starting with the first one. Each other, I know we feel the same About the situation Like we're stuck inside a game Time to get out of this circle Yeah, we both carry a scar As you write the part we're playing Time to cherish who we are the only thing I ever wanted Starts with us taking the chance Not like anything we've done before Or, oh, or, oh, yeah Now it's time for something better And time for us to follow our dreams Hands go side to side And here we go, 30 seconds Don't be afraid Next one, you're going to flip your fingers back towards your knees, and you're going to rock back to go into the stretch. Here we go, 30 seconds. Always mixed emotions. The first step is always hard. When you walk out of the doorway, but that's just the place to start. The only thing I ever wanted starts with us taking the chance. Not like anything we've done before. Oh, oh, yeah. Now it's time for something better. Time for us to follow our dreams No, we can't stay no more Come run away And last one, circles We will go 15 seconds in one direction 15 seconds in the other direction Here we go Great job with the wrist rocks. Hopefully everything is feeling good from that. From there, we are going to transition into more strengthening type moves. With this move specifically, we are working on strengthening the extensors, the one that are pulling our hands back while lengthening the flexors. Here's how it will go. Hands will go together. You're going to drop your fingers down open up your hands as far as you can go. Keeping your whole entire forearm together, working on trying to pull back your hands as far as you can go. We're gonna hold it for 10 seconds, come back up, and we're gonna do that five times. Here we go. And bring yourself back up, and then we do it again. We keep on telling lies That is how we stay alive mm. So you know that I don't mind About what is wrong and what is right We keep moving in different rhythms Still I know what you feel
job with those. Moving on into a pretty similar move to that, except we are not going to have our hands together. We are strictly focusing a lot on the hands, being able to spread our hands as much as we can and then grip them super tight, transitioning the strengthening into our hands and then progressing with the next two moves that we have after this part. You will extend your fingers and your hands as much as you can, holding it for 10 seconds, and then we'll grip our fingers really, 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 really tight like you're making a fist, holding that for 10 seconds. We're gonna go back and forth. Each are going to do it five times, so it is 10. Look at me being really good at math. Here we go. 10 seconds, spread, and let's get to it. And make those fists. into the floor grips, learning to put weight onto our hands. We are going down to the floor, learning to grip our fingers into the ground. You'll set your hands up almost like what we were doing with the wrist rocks before, not having any weight on your hands yet. You're going to grip your fingers into the floor. Then you're going to put weight on, and we're gonna hold that for 10 seconds, five times. You know the drill. Here we go. I hear your laughter from within You can light up any room without going in Funny how just a few letters in a row Can turn into a smile and now you can let go Oh, oh, we see the distance grow I just need to know that we have done today. Rolled, worked on range of motion, increasing range of motion, strengthened our flexors and our hands, and now we will apply it to a plank without any pain. 
I will go over quickly how to do a plank and then we will do 30 seconds, three sets, resting 10 seconds in between together. You will set yourself up in a plank, actually starting the way that we did with the floor grip. So you will place your hands onto the floor, not putting too much pressure into your wrists yet. Really, 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 really get a good, good grip with your hands. Then you will shift your weight over one leg. We'll go back at a time, tuck your pelvis under, pull your belly button up into the ceiling, push your chest away and head away from the floor. And then we will hold that for 30 seconds. We're all in this together. Here we go. Wish I could say I was finally over you, but that's not the truth. Everyone always keep falling in love again What's wrong with them? I don't understand Maybe it will pass by someone save me For I pass out, I'm too lonely To be done, I'm a drink at this page to be someone else I would and let go of you mm -mm. I know that I'm obvious forget I'm made this way but why didn't I stay when I had the chance maybe it will pass by someone save me for a pass out I'm too lonely to be done in my drink at this pace range of motion together again you and I were in this together make sure to come back one to two times a week always working on increasing the range of motion in your wrist I hope you have a great day and I will see you next time bye